This is how I make a batik painting from beginning to end. It starts off as white silk and I use melted wax as a resist to keep the dye out. I have to work in color progressions moving from the lightest of a color to the darkest. So for this one I'm starting with a light yellow, moving from yellow to orange to red, and later when I add blues all the yellows will help me make my greens. So you do have to plan out your colors pretty well. In the dye bath, there's dye, urea, and salt, and then I add soda ash fixative halfway through the dye bath to make the dye set. Here you see I'm just moving from color to color, and then now that I have all the warm colors, I'm gonna take all the wax off by ironing and boiling multiple times. Between each boil, I let the water um, cool, and then the wax floats to the top, and I can just sieve it off like this. Boil it again till I stop getting any wax on top. So now that I have all the warm colors, I want to cover everything I want to keep warm and then put everything else in some blue. So I'll make blues and greens and purples. And then I'm just going to move from a lighter blue to a darker blue so that I have some variations in both the sky and the landscape. There you have it. And so once again, I'm going to need to take all the wax off of this guy. So back to the boiling pot boil it a few times and then I wanted to stretch this one around some wood so I'm just carefully carefully stretching it around some wood with my staple gun and in the end it's ready to hang voila